the history of this little 68 Bronco, I know a lot about because Miner and I won the Bob 1000 overall in it in 69. But after a while, I, I was the one that kept winning races for Bill Strop. So he finally built Fricker and I a new Bronco. So that Bronco there was sold to uh, two friends of ours in Barstow, California. And they raced it for a couple of years, but they had a problem keeping it on four wheels. So they left it in a wrecking yard in Barstow, California. That Bronco sat in that wrecking yard for maybe 35, 37 years. A friend of mine, Gail Pike, he heard that that Bronco was still there at that Barstow wrecking yard. They went out to find it. So this guy says, uh, I think there's I think your Bronco's out and back somewhere. So they went out and all they found was the number 56 sticking out of sand. So Gail Pike paid the five grand and then had it painted up and then just parked it out at one of his restaurants. Then when I started the Hall of Fame, Gail Pike donated it to the Off-Road Motorsports Hall of Fame. This Bronco has been sitting in the exhibit since 2003. And so it's really awesome to see it come out and it's going to be alive and racing down the Baja Peninsula again. From 1967 to today, I've participated in every Baja 1000. Fortunately, I met Chris Collard and he says, I think we ought to fix this up and race it. If you're gonna restore a car the way I see it, you gotta go completely through it. You can't just do this and that and hope the other part holds up. So here at Samco, we build trick off-road racing vehicles, but this Bronco isn't that. We want to preserve the heritage of the Bronco. We want to keep things just like they were back when it raced in 1969. It is really fun for me to be able to see my grandfather getting back in the seat of the truck that he holds records in. Shelby, my granddaughter, and I drove that thing, I think, close to 1,300 miles. Literally, we didn't have a mechanical problem with that Bronco all the way from Ensenada to San Jose del Cabo. If we'd raise the hood, it's only to check the oil. And that set of tires you see on there are the same four tires that we started the race on. I think that says something for BF Goodrich, I think.